is, well, it's a Scottish beer, but they're kind of making it a little Viking, but I'm excited. It's called Kelpie. And why am I laughing about this? Um, it's it's actually made with seaweed, which seems pretty cool. What's yours again? This is, this is Dixie. Dixie. Dixie? This is a beer brewed in New Orleans. All the way from New Orleans. You're drinking with Einstein. <laughs> Hi, Albert. Here, I should get beer too. I love I'm Albert. trying yours. Anyways. Mm, it's just mm, it's like a very, very... It's almost like I can't even scent anything. Yeah. But I, they're like little bubbles hitting my nostrils, so I know I should be sensing something. Yeah. So, um, okay. Wow, that is wicked hot, man. <laughs> <laughs> he just had a taste of the, um... <laughs> How is that? <laughs> Wicked hoppy, and yes, citrus and the double dog. An almond. And it just, it doesn't want to leave your mouth. Oh I no, it like don't. I just bit into like a pear. <laughs> it's very fruity, I like it. Yeah. I like this drink. Can I try another sip? Shh. <laughs> but for later. Why, thank you. Yeah, I like that. Hey, there's significantly less alcohol in this thing. Sorry. You're drinking. <clears throat> Okokium. It's a Polish beer. And your drink brew was... Dixie. Dixie. Brewed in New Orleans. New Orleans. Anyways. And, uh, well, there, there's my bottle. So, Double Dog. When you want hops, you want Double Dog. <laughs> it's very hoppy. It's hop <laughs> Very hoppy. And now to clean the palate. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me laugh. You do it to me, I was trying to Until drink. after I've swallowed. God damn it. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you walked right into that. You know that, right? No, that would suck. <laughs> you just strolled right on into that. Like, skipping, like, la, 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 la. Like, I wouldn't write home about it, but it's beer, and it's pretty tasty. This beer has been taunting me since I found it, and I've wanted to to get folks together to drink it. It's a large sum beer, but yeah, Kelpie should be interesting. It is a it is a, a Scottish seaweed beer. Beer cam. Kelpie. Made with seaweed. Just to show you folks that you can make beer out of pretty much anything. Kelpie. Kelpie. Seaweed ale brewed with natural flavor. Micro brewed for maximum flavor. Brewed in Muddle in Scotland. Prior to the 1850s, many Scottish coastal ale houses brewed their own ales using local malted barley grown on fields fertilized with seaweed. We have recreated local malted brewery grown fields fertilized with sorry I'm reading the same line again <laughs> <laughs> we have created the unique flavor of this traditional ale with the inclusion of fresh seaweed so you will taste the seaweed like your ancestors didn't because they didn't get fresh seaweed <laughs> we have uh, inclusion of fresh seaweed so it doesn't taste anything with the old one uh, bladder bet rack, which is taken fresh from the water on the uh, something coast, something something. Yeah, I don't believe any of that. Kelpie. Viking ale. Let's see what it tastes Hang like. On, wait, let me get a close wait, up of that. Wait, we gotta finish our beers. It's gotta go in a glass. You're, you're, you're jumping the gun. No, I'm not. Here, hold this. Here, hold this. Let me, let me hold that. I'll, I'll help you. <laughs> <laughs> now you have a glass. You want to rinse it? Fine. <laughs> <laughs> my my choice of bottle opener is this. Not not this part, but this part here. I like these because you just get a little leverage. 
and you can preserve the cap because they make awesome decorations. All right, now we don't know what color this is. It could be green. We don't know. So are you guys ready? I am ready. Do it. Oh, it's dark. It's a black like blood with a frothy cover. Oh, it's dark. <clears throat> That's going to put hairs on your chest right there. I also like. for the ladies. It, it does have a slight, it claims to have a, what is it? Um, Kelpie is a rich chocolate ale with an aroma of fresh sea breeze and a distinctive malty texture. Don't lose that. That's going to go on our thing. Damn it. I wanted to steal it and make no. it my own. It's going on our coat rack thing. Damn, I'm going to have to buy a But it does have a, a sea breeze nose. This better taste good. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm kind of like, I don't know if I want to, do I have to, damn it. All right. I could be your poison like. taster. Well, with a look like that, <laughs> <laughs> it tastes kind of like soy sauce. <laughs> it honestly tastes a little bit like sushi, <laughs> like liquid, like just just soy sauce, rice, and seaweed. That's it. Put into a blender and then Vikings filter. ate sushi before the Japanese did. <laughs> Here is Nate King standing for Sean Connery. Right? I'm sorry. Oh, I tried that one more. <laughs> yes, this is a very interesting brew. I'm not quite exactly sure who did it. Um, it's it's almost like how the other thing I couldn't smell anything and I was just hit, hit by little bubbles. This feels like I'm being hit with basketballs. <laughs> okay, when I was smelling it. Um, it's. Um, I think I've tr I think I tried to taste this at least twice now, and I think my uh, memory has blocked out the f the memory the taste of the memory from my memory because uh, it's so awful. I don't remember. It, uh, it must be trying to repress. Trying to repress. Breakthrough. Confrontational psychology. I can see where you're coming with the sushi angle. And the soy sauce. The soy sauce. You know, it, I can see that. It's just kind of interesting. It's I like very that. seaweedy. All right. But I imagine it's so much more. <laughs> yeah, chocolate. It don't taste like chocolate. Yeah, soy sauce. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! I don't know if it's because you two planned it in my mind, because you said it, or. <laughs> so chocolate plus sea breeze <laughs> you will soy, sauce. soy sauce, huh? That's one for your whatever that stupid phone app thing is. Hey, you're putting pre digit judgment on him, you know? <laughs> Advertise, and I think it's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I gotta try it again. There is, there is, there is a decided, there is a decided note of like fresh salt air, which is okay. Follow, fo which lasts for approximately half the note, and then that ends. <sighs> and then there is, uh, I'd say about what's this, probably about a ninety percent cacao chocolate. The the other half. Underneath of which is this is very very malty texture. It's not sweet. It's not that there's a lot of malt in it. The texture is just very malty. This is a thick, thick beer, and it just kind of sits there like the sand. <laughs> Obviously, and you get and you get a wave of sea of, of seawater, and you get a wave of chocolate to Ala Willy Wonka. I, um, yeah, I think that's horrible. still have the image of the sushi dinner in my head for how we I flavor this. I didn't notice the chocolate. If it was chocolate, it would have to be dark chocolate because yeah, uh, milk chocolate has a completely different taste. Personally, I think it's better than dark chocolate. I know there's some people say that oh the charlatan, but anyways, let me taste this here.
Maybe now I feel like, um, I don't know what I'm tasting. I think my brain just wanted to create the illusion that it was sushi and soy sauce. Because <coughs> I heard you say it. Next time uh, we need to keep our comments results. We're going to try it out of the bottle because it might be one of those rare things that, that the bottle somehow helps. Alright. Keep going. That's quite a face. You know how when you were a kid and you had a goldfish and you used to smell the fish food when you would open it? It tastes like that. That's what this tastes like. <laughs> it tastes like how fish food smells. Like goldfish and, flakes. Um, okay, well in that case what I'd have to say about this beer is <sighs> that your mind will avoid answering the question of how does this taste. Basically what happens is your mind will reach to any other part of your existence pulling up imagery just so it doesn't have to describe to your brain how awful this beer is. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, so never again. Putting seaweed in beer is a bad idea. We have learned this now. <laughs> no, I will say... Attention, is... Scotland! I... Don't put seaweed in your beer! Now, I can think of a redeeming factor for this. This would be great to use as something to steam muscles or some other, like, shellfish in. That <laughs> would add a really, really great boiling. flavor. <laughs> so this could totally be used for cooking. Um, if I was going to do something with some nice mussels, I would put this in and use this to steam them in instead of just straight water. Because um, it would kill them before they got boiled. Because <laughs> 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 um, You know, I, I can see this being really tasty if you, you know, like, did something with lobster. You know, maybe you gave the lobster this before you killed it. I don't want to die here, beer. <laughs> it's it's you know, well, shit, kill me, baby, give me this crap. Um, unfortunately, I was really excited about this beer. I was hoping it was going to be great, and and I think um, I think this one might be uh, destined for taps. I think this one might be going down the drain because I'm sure as hell not finishing this because already I'm getting the like fish food burst. Yeah, please don't drink that. I, I would fear for your health. I think this is just... You know what's scary? Ow. Ooh, she's actually doing it. Film it. I think Stand what's up. scary um, is this might like unclog the drain a little bit. Bye bye. I know I'm wasting beer, but um. I wouldn't call that a waste. I'm not quite sure I'd call that beer. That's a review. That right there is a review. That was vicious. All right, next. <laughs> it, 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 it's bad. It's bad. That's two <laughs> thumbs down in the camera right there. Wait, uh, I, 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 hang on. <laughs> <laughs> you put them on two different angles.